Impact Plus. Experience Impact Wrestling like never before. Tonight, we are uncaged in Mexico City, Mexico. Moments away from a Knockouts Championship street fight. This following contest is catching for a rival. And it is for the Knockouts Championship. Introducing first the number one contender from Charlotte, North Carolina. Tessa Blanchard! And I understand from my sources that that shirt she's wearing, that Four Horsemen shirt, is the actual shirt that Tully Blanchard, her father, wore in a street fight. Yeah, look at that! She's sending a message. I wonder if Tully's giving her some tricks of the trade, Josh. Tessa's starting hot, and she just got rocked by a right hand by the champ. Taya Valkyrie saw Tessa Blanchard coming. Tessa was sprinting up the ramp with a steel chair. This, this is Tessa Blanchard's first match back since she was suspended by Impact Wrestling. And something tells me this might be Tessa's first street fight, but I know for a fact it's not Taya's. This is nasty right from the start. Look at that face paint on Taya. What a way to kick off Uncaged here tonight in Mexico City. We invite you to join in on the conversation tonight, folks. Use the hashtag Impact. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram at Impact Wrestling. What in the world did Taya just get? She got a chair. Big time kick there by Tessa Blanchard, the former Knockouts champion. This has been a rivalry building for quite some time, Don. It had to end here in this street fight, yes? Absolutely, and Tessa's father, Tully, was a master of street fights, a master of dirty tactics. He had to impart some for tonight on Tessa. Different look from the champion, Taya Valkyrie, as well. You mentioned she's been in street fights, most likely here in Mexico when she competed with AAA. Spent a lot of time down here, and she's a rough customer, I can tell you that. Former Put the brakes on. Randa De Reyes champion, Kurt. Oh, wow. oh, God, she just tossed her. German suplex, their rules of the street fight. Anything goes, folks. Trying to get those fists into the face of Tessa. And look at the face of Taya, the champion. No count outs. Oh, wow. No disqualifications. Those aren't wrestling boots, Josh. Those look like work boots to me. Got him styled up a little bit, but nevertheless, kicking right into the spine of Tessa Blanchard. You can see the effects that it has on the body of Tessa, who kicks out. Many people don't oh. say that Tessa, she's sort of driven this rivalry to this. Look at this, Tessa trying to cover up those sharp forearms of Taya raining down, and now Taya's gonna take it outside one more time. It was at homecoming where Tessa Blanchard she went after Gail Kim, the Hall of Famer, the guest referee in that match. That's what Te cost her the championship. Tessa's a hot oh, hand. Oh, oh wow! Taya walked right into it. She was showboating to the hometown crowd here, and Tessa made her pay. Well, Tessa can take her frustrations oh. out on Taya Valkyrie here tonight. Again, no count outs out there. Oh, into the steel post goes the head of the champion. Anything goes, and the fans here in Mexico getting behind Taya Valkyrie. Yeah, she's going to need it. Tessa Blanchard is a great front runner, and she's going to take full advantage. Now got the steel oh, chair. Oh, my. Oh, wow. Threw that steel chair right at the head, and it found its mark. We saw Tessa do this at homecoming. Not with the chair, oh, though. Oh, wow. She dented that chair with that double drop kick. Full force into the head of Taya. What an incredible street fight for the Knockouts Championship here at Uncaged. Don, is this where Tessa is so dangerous when she has this confidence? Oh, absolutely. And 
We talked about the strength advantage. Big kick by Taya. Oh! Right to the back of it, right behind the ear there. Now, Taya has a power advantage, but all the weightlifting in the world will protect you from a big shot to the face with a chair. Oh! Wow, she just dumped her over that steel guardrail into the first row. Yeah, they spilled into the fans here in front in Mexico. Not sure that Taya Valkyrie's gonna use that. Well, maybe she will. Oh! It's like a, I guess that's a cup of beer into the eyes of Tessa. That brought the fans to their feet. A high five for the Knockouts champion. Those are high guardrails we got here in front of oh. Mexico. Big kick. Tessa Cotter. Well, Don, with the way this match started, we didn't get a chance to talk strategy in a street fight. Who has the advantage in this one? What have you seen thus far? Ooh. I've been impressed with Tessa because I actually thought she would be at a distinct disadvantage because I don't think she's had this. Oh, look at that. Well, that'll get you suspended again. Oh, boy. Oh, no. Look out now. Oh! oh, wow! You get chills when you see that dawn to Taya Valkyrie because her husband has suffered that fate. Her husband, Johnny Impact, has felt that same move from the likes of Killer Cross and Moose. What is Tessa doing now? Wants a cameraman out of her way. Barking at everybody. She's got some cable there from the, from the audio table. This is not going to be good. This match is getting more and more dangerous by the second. Tessa oh, Blanchard. He's trying to jump oh, the she's line. Got it under her nose, too. Taya desperately trying to get those fingers in to create some separation. Once she loses that, she's going to get choked out or worse. Taya was fading rapidly. Tessa changes the game plan. She's ripping her clothes off. What's going on here? This is all legal, Josh. Tessa Blanchard is a lunatic. This has been 75% Tessa. I think that Tessa was sending a message. That shirt that she was wearing, that Taya had on was from a faction. Los Perros de Mall, the most extreme Mexican faction of the late Pero Aguayo, a longtime friend of Taya Valkyrie. Uh-huh. And disrespect from Tessa. She spit on that shirt, Don. Tessa is so good in this match. Oh, wow, right in the head. And that's a momentum changer for Taya. Tessa was hell-bent on sending a message, and it may have backfired. The window open now for the Knockouts champion. The eyes rolling into the back of the head of the challenger. And Taya with the clothesline. At what point, Don, does the power advantage take control for the champion? Well, she needs to keep those steel chairs out of the hands of Tessa. That's a start. They've spilled into the crowd here in front in Mexico. Oh! Now in the ring, and the champion is in control. What is this now? What play? Oh, boy. Oh, no. What is that? Well, Josh, I'll let you call this one. Oh, shit! God. Cover! Heel hook! And a kick out there. The very edge of that pan jackhammered to the lower region, I guess you call it, of Tessa Blanchard. That has got to hurt, Josh. Ty was looking for the road to Valhalla. Oh. And a counter there by Tessa Blanchard, but you can see the challenger quickly Back to her feet, she rolls away. Damage has been done to Tessa in this match. The experience in a match like this, is that showing here for Taya? It really is, but the thing is, Tessa, this is like her first street fight. I gotta wonder, is there anything Tessa Blanchard can't do, Josh? I don't think so. Especially when she wants her championship back, especially after she was embarrassed. She lost the title, she was suspended. She goes for the cover. And the champion Whoa! kicks out. Very close, very close.
Tessa again goes to the outside. She grabbed some production cables earlier, so we don't know what she's capable or looking for now. More and more steel chairs from underneath the ring. Scary, Don, but she looks comfortable in this environment. Well, Tessa Blanchard is an aggressive person, so you transplant that into this, and instead of hitting a top rope drop kick, you swing a chair. Continues to fill the ring with steel chairs in this street fight for the Knockouts Championship. I would go so far as to say Tessa Blanchard hates Ty of Valkyrie, Josh. Tessa going up top, looking to put, oh, and there's a steel chair! Tessa teetering now, she's gonna fall off, where is she? Remember, it was Tessa who put the chairs into the ring. And now champion and challenger in a dangerous situation. And Taya! Oh, wow, right on the chairs. But Taya got the bad end of that as well there. She landed on a chair herself, Josh. Knockouts championship on the line. It's a street fight between Tessa Blanchard and Taya Valkyrie. It continues after this. Welcome back to Impact Wrestling. This is Uncaged. We kick off the night with the Knockouts Championship, a street fight in Mexico City, Mexico, between the champion, Taya Valkyrie, and the challenger, Tessa Blanchard. Look out, Taya's gone out of her mind, but they're trading forearms. I'd pick up a chair here, Josh. Taya Valkyrie gained control right before the commercial break and remained in control throughout the break. Tessa oh. trying to get something going now. Look at these two staring at each other down, the hatred and the venom spewing. Slaps to the face, back and forth, God. Allowing each other to trade back and forth. Who will get the better of this? Taya, big time oh kick! Oh my God! About took her head off. Right into the face Tessa's out. of the former champion, Taya, looking to retain in a kick out from Tessa Blanchard. Somehow, Tessa, after eating that foot through the chair, found the intestinal fortitude to kick out. Our legacy is being born here tonight at Uncaged. As Taya Valkyrie is looking to put away Tessa Blanchard, who ducks the clothesline. Oh, and a spear! Oh, a God. spear! They bounced off! Fans showing their appreciation. Gonna go for it again, watch out! Oh, God! And she is brutalizing Taya, running her into that table. Tessa drags the carcass of the champion. Cover, and Whoa. somehow, some way, Taya Valkyrie stays alive at two. Here we go, Taya now measuring, or Tessa rather, measuring Taya. I would get a chair and just start swinging and finish this thing, Josh. Well, Tessa's got other plans, because there's plenty of chairs in the ring. Tessa Blanchard has a table. Tyus down, she's not moving, Josh. No, two times she was sent into the corner, speared by Tessa Blanchard. Tessa now got some other heinous business in mind. Setting up the table. And Tessa Blanchard has a huge opportunity here. What does she have in mind? Rabbit punching to the back of the head of Ty. Oh, no. Ty is prone. She's got nowhere to go. And Tessa's going to measure her up. Look out now. Taya sends the challenger off. Avoids disaster. And Taya Valkyrie is going up top. Oh, my gosh. And takes down oh. Tessa Blanchard with a crossbody. 
One more look at this as Taya Valkyrie was in trouble and has somehow turned to this thing 180 degrees. Crowd solidly behind La Huera Loca. And now Taya is stalking Tessa. She goes for another cover and a quick kick out. Yeah, Tessa's out at one and a half. Still fight left in Tessa Blanchard, the third generation superstar. We've seen this submission maneuver from Taya Valkyrie in the past. It forced Tessa to tap out once upon a time. Yeah, nicely countered by Tessa. Oh! Knee! Oh. Tessa Blanchard on the table. Taya looking to capitalize. Tessa trying to get up. Oh, a double stomp! Through the table, shoulders down, and Taya Valkyrie retains. La ganadora, y todavía campeona de las locas, la huera loca, Taya Valkyrie. Taya Valkyrie has somehow vanquished Tessa Blanchard here tonight, solidifying her reign as Knockouts Champion. What a way to kick off the night. What a way to kick off Uncaged here in Mexico City, Mexico.